No, Clem. We learned that everything we will ever do is dangerous. We'll get better, smarter, and faster, okay? Okay. They didn't have much business back then. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm a little shaky. It'll pass. I've found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Hi, girls. Hey. We were trying to get used to being on our own, Clementine and I. So you take her into a dark, boarded-up building to build character? Not exactly. I think it's a good idea, figuring stuff out for yourself, for what it's worth. But be smart about it, though, you know? Teach her to scan the area for things. You two should never be looking in the same spot. That's a waste. Stay the hell out of places like that building over there, especially if you don't have more than one way to get out. And be more afraid of groups of living men than dead folk. That we know. Omid and I are still alive because we're two, not six or eight or ten. I don't believe in strength in numbers, and you shouldn't either. This would create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through. Someone's managed to keep the spirit. As soon as that thing comes down, we'll be on our way. Yeah. And I hope we won't have any more trouble out of you. I promise you won't. There's a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Hope this holds. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. I can't reach it now. Here. The weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no. But I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting.
We gotta go! Fuck. Omi! Cut! Cut! I am! It's going! Pull me up! Kenny, go! Gotta jump! What? No way! Guys! Jump! No! Jump, damn it! Still no! Fine! She's a woman, don't you know? As fuck. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. Next stop, the Atlantic. We're finding Clementine's parents when we get there. I thought they were dead. Looking for them, then. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. It's gotten too bad, you know? You, me, nobody can take all this. But we have. What we're supposed to do isn't clear anymore. I'd give anything to go back to fighting over the motel. <sighs> me too. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. That fucking thing was broken. So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents. Y'all might want to rethink your plan. at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? I know I promised that we'd find your parents. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. 
I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now! Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you! You understand? I will kill you! <laughs> 